Tonight, I'll escape from Hong Kong by plane. Due to the protests, the Intang check-in is not in operation. But thankfully, I've already checked in yesterday night. And so, I can go take the airport express. That night, there were rumors of some disturbance in Terminal 1. As a result, I'll go airside via Terminal 2. Now that I was safely airside, I had an unpleasant surprise at the bridge lounge. I can now head back to Terminal 1. Unfortunately, due to the protests, the bridge lounge is closed. As a result, I'll head to the pier lounge. <laughs> Let's make myself comfortable. I will have an egg tart with a creme brulee latte. There were fewer crew members than usual on this flight because so many of them were on strike. Start with some orange juice. No one sat next to me. It's time to take the window seat. We are taxiing for takeoff. Now, what's for dinner? This is the menu. For supper, I can 
choose between the stir-fried beef fillet, the pan-fried cod, or the rigatoni. For breakfast, I can choose between the English breakfast or the Chinese dim sum. Here's a bottle of Avion mineral water. I'm having the beef fillet with rice. The food tasted like something out of a typical Hong Kong lunchbox. Now let's have some ice cream. Previously, someone asked me how full cafe flights are in general. Well, here's the answer. There are loads of empty seats in this cabin. Before I forget, let's have a closer look at the seat and the entertainment system. There's a TV screen in front of me, along with a tablet stand. The remote control and a headphone jack can be found to my left, along with the inclination controls. There is plenty of space in the seat. It should be pretty comfy. Premium economy passengers are provided with a pair of noise-cancelling headphones. This time, you can watch me struggle with the touchscreen and my brand new Xiaomi. You start by selecting the language. I slept for nearly five hours. I've woken up with two and a half hours to go. It's time to brush my teeth. The lights are back on. breakfast. It will be dim sum this time.
It was a relief to be back in the UK. I have reached London Gatwick. I can leave by train. Thank you for watching. If you like what I'm doing, please like, share, and subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to click the bell as well. I'll see you soon.